guys, welcome back to our channel, or welcome if you are new. We're going to be making a large iced coffee. Charlie is behind me on the horse, just bouncing away. Yeah. Where's my cat? Oh my god, my cat was right here the whole time. Okay, we are going to be making a coffee. There is so many noises going on right now. I don't know if the camera's picking it up, but we have the ice maker going, we have Paw Patrol, the movie going, and we have some show on Netflix going in the living room for Tommy. So give me one second. I think we're good. All right, go eat, please. Let me grab my coffee stuff first. I am currently seven weeks postpartum, dear Deli Carmel. I don't always do this, but today I thought, hey, why not? Anyways, I am seven weeks postpartum. I was like, okay, when is my checkup? You know, you would think, you know, six weeks postpartum, and I'm like, did I miss it? Am I forgetting it? Usually I get like a phone call or like a text message that says, hey, your postpartum or your appointment's coming up. And I did it. So I went onto my chart. I went onto my chart and apparently my postpartum checkup isn't until May 4th, which I would be about 10 weeks postpartum. All throughout your pregnancy, you have so many doctor's appointments you're being checked up on, but as soon as you give birth to that baby, they just don't care. Um, not saying that my doctors don't care, I'm just saying in general, like there's no checkups after that. I personally believe that postpartum, there should be like a two week checkup and then your six week checkup. And that two week checkup needs to be more on, you know, how's your mental health doing? How is breastfeeding if you are going or feeding in general? How's the baby, you know, all of that stuff because at two weeks postpartum for me like breastfeeding and stuff like that I wanted to give up my nipples hurt my boobs are sore I felt like I wasn't doing it correctly baby blues like all of that stuff I feel like I really could have benefited from a two-week checkup and then also if you had like questions you know how's your bleeding um, you know if you had a c-section how's that going I don't know if you have like a two week or something checkup with a C-section. I don't know how that works. Um, but if you don't, I feel like you should, you know what I mean? And so I really feel like they really need to put in that week checkup on top of the six week checkup. Speaking of like mental health, Starbucks, medium roast, unsweetened, it's only 15 calories really good i did experience baby blues which baby blues for me is completely different than my anxiety and depression for me baby blues was a lot of crying like crying at literally anything like i could just look at my child and cry that lasted about i want to say like like a week that yeah, baby blues is not fun um, I had a lot of like I wish he was still in my belly even though I wanted him not out of my belly But I wanted him back in my belly because I knew he was like, you know what I mean? Like it's all of those emotions Starbucks zero sugar Creamer I got asked on Instagram where I got this or was it TikTok? I can't remember um, Target Target zero sugar. I don't notice a difference um, But yeah, it's only 20 calories zero sugar I like it because I like creamer. Did experience baby blues and um, on top of it, I already have anxiety and depression. My depression is more from my anxiety, if that makes sense. Like I get so anxious and then it like just throws me into depression. I have been on sertraline 150 milligrams my entire pregnancy. Um, it was just better for me to be on it than not be on it at all. There has been some points postpartum that I have forgotten to take it just because like I've just gotten so like busy or tired and just, you know, and forgotten to take it. And then all of a sudden I'll start getting like dizzy, like really dizzy. That's like the main symptom for me if I forget to take it. And um, how my anxiety is doing, anxiety is still anxiety. Like I feel like 
the medication will never just like turn my brain off but it does help like I don't get panic attacks like I used to knock on wood because that I probably just jinxed myself mm, so good speaking of like postpartum like depression anxiety this video later on you guys will see like oh when it gets kind of like that bad um how my house gets and how our house is not always clean i get that all the time of how is your house always clean with five kids trust me it's not and for the most part it is and that is because i'm just i'm just mental because um i have to have a clean home or it's gonna mess with my mental health there's just so many changes postpartum like postpartum hair loss my hair is a lot thinner um you know like the weight doesn't just fall off and you know it's just a lot of stuff postpartum and us women are amazing pretty much like what our bodies go through and you know we're we're awesome anyways we're gonna jump into this video. Um, we did some cleaning, some organizing, um, fruit prep. We did all of that stuff. You guys are really seeing my house in its raw form. I don't think I've ever showed our house this dirty, not even dirty, it's not dirty, this messy before. So stay tuned. Um, this is real, this is raw, um, real life. So uh, let's just, Let's just jump into it. Also really wanted to talk about my Mom Cozy Pump. I have been using it for a couple weeks now and I love it. I love that I don't have to be attached to cords and that I can just put it on and still do my day-to-day -day things, especially as a busy mom of five now. Like I cannot just be sitting there attached to a pump. The Mom Cozy Pumps have nine adjustable suction levels and two modes to choose from. It also is equipped with an LED display for easy operation and memory function. The Mom Cozy is easy to put together and take apart to wash. There's not many parts to wash, which is so nice. There's nothing worse than having a bunch of pump parts that you need to keep clean. I am going to leave a discount code down below if you guys want to check out the Mom Cozy and get one for yourself. You can use my code there23 to get 23% off of your Mom Cozy pump. This is valid from April 18th to May 8th. So I will leave a link down below if you guys want to check it out. Kids love all types of fruit, but their favorite fruits are strawberries, raspberries, blueberries, and grapes. So I wanted to get all of those washed and prepped and put in the fridge so it is an easy grab for them. This is 
is so embarrassing to even show, but we are a large family. We are a family of seven, and if we do not do laundry every single day, this is how our laundry looks. And we went out of town for the weekend, and for some reason, it just got piled up. It gets piled up so fast. There's seven of us showering. We have my laundry, Gage's laundry, all five of the kids' laundry, and like I said, it just piles up so quickly so we need to be doing laundry every single day or this is what it looks like um and so we needed to get a start on that and just put away and thankfully now it is back to how um it usually is just a little bit of laundry but yes this is real life and this is what laundry looks like in our household Another thing that's so embarrassing to show but this is real life especially with a newborn and it's not like it's dirty it's just everything kind of just out of place like just kind of thrown there so we needed to get that cleaned up and everything put away every time I'm going out the same things keep happening new boy same tricks all the fruit for me because it was in the fridge we ate dinner and now I'm filming the haul right at the top the strawberries the raspberries the blueberries and if you can hear the pumps I do have the mom cozy pumps on right now which is super nice because I am hands-free and able to do this so I'm going to show you what we got from Target and Walmart I'm just gonna move these oh we need the cucumber oh the cucumber is out already I'm trying to see make sure we have everything we have yes and in one second okay so we're gonna start with target okay, so we picked up this like basketball like bouncy ball thing from the target dollar spot charlie got like a basketball hoop like a used one um and so we needed to pick up a ball for that dab some pillowcases this is just room essential king um, just in gray. We needed more band-aids because Charlie got his first owie last week and um, pretty much used up all the band-aids because he just needed a band-aid even though it was just a tiny little scrape. Um, a lighted makeup mirror. This was in the dollar section. I believe this was five dollars. Maya wanted this for her room and then I got this little stand. I kind of, I, okay, so I like this but I'm thinking about this, I'm not sure. Moving on to drinks, I saw these Gatorade Fit and I wanted to try them out. It says no added sugar, artificial sweeteners or flavors, no added colors, and an excellent source of vitamins A and C. So we picked three of these up. I believe this one is citrus berry. We have a strawberry watermelon and then back here we have a peach mango. 
And then I saw these. It is just Caribou Cold Brew, um, just the original crafted one. I have two of them. Let me know if you guys have a Caribou by you. I believe Caribou is only a Midwest thing. So let me know if you guys have a Caribou. Um, but these were not ringing up. I swear, you guys, every time... I go to the store and like something doesn't ring up. I always get such a good deal. Um, but these were not ringing up and she asked me how much they were and I really don't pay attention to the prices. So I was like, I have no idea. And she's like, how does 50 cents sound? And I said, sure. So I got both of these for a dollar, 50 cents each. So that's kind of cool. Um, you guys know I love these sparkling ice caffeine. So I got the black raspberry and then the watermelon lemonade. And then this one is the cherry vanilla. So good. Um, let's see. Okay, so Noah hit a girl spurt, like a major girl spurt, and literally put on his clothes and none of them fit even some of the new jammies and pants that we got him so being the oldest boy he does not get any hand-me-downs and so we needed to pick him some we needed to pick up some pants for him so we have these cat and jack joggers which right now cat and jack is actually having 15 percent off and these sparkling ice caffeines were also 15 15 percent off on the cartwheel app so good deals we love sales um, okay, so we got this Cat and Jack jogger and then just these pair of Cat and Jack straight jeans. And then we also picked Weston up some as well. We have these Cat and Jack joggers and I really like the sides. They're super soft. And then we have these Cat and Jack skinnies, but they're not like the buttons because Weston is very picky and he does not like the buttons on his jeans. So picked those up all of these were 15 percent off each so good deal and then we headed over to walmart and at walmart we picked up our pillows we for some reason had no pillows like it was very limited so at walmart we did pick up pillows and i will show you those when we get upstairs um we picked up some raspberry some bananas Ugh, the bananas were just terrible these are the best i could find one's an organic kind which i'm not picky with like organic um but one's an organic kind and then just this kind like i said they are not the best um a cucumber oranges or cuties we have blueberries uh blackberries strawberries and then these um mini apples is what they're called i got a mouse it's a tiny one for mca i got a mouse for mca testing mca testing is this week and she she didn't need a wireless mouse they would provide one but i also wanted one for my computer so we just picked one up make sure you put your headphones in there as well um we saw this this is just like popcorn like a snack popcorn my husband is obsessed with Reese eggs and of course after Easter they're on sale so these were only like a dollar fifty and so he grabbed three bags uh, the spray paints were also on sale in like that clearance section and so this pretty baby pink one we picked up just to have on hand and then just a red and then the weather's starting to get warmer which I love to self tan so we have the face self tanner and then just this tanned af i've never tried this so i'm a little nervous because i'm i really like the neutrogena one um but we'll see how this goes and then we have some more of the downy light and parents choice baby laundry detergent so that is everything that we got from target and walmart all right you guys i'm actually going to end this vlog thank you so much for watching like seriously Thank you, um, and to everyone that has subscribed or is following our channel, our Instagram, thank you. Thank you for following along on this like journey of parenthood, motherhood, familyhood. Um, but yeah, if you are not subscribed, definitely do that. Turn your notification um, bell on so you never miss a video. I know you guys understand or kind of like patient with me. I just had a baby and so like getting vlogs out consistently is um, a little hard but I am trying. I want to try to do two to three videos a week but let me know what you guys want to see. So thank you guys so much for watching and we'll talk to you in our next vlog. Bye.